I believe I can get into the settings and maybe go make it go faster. <laughs> Hi, this is Spencer from Caravan Radio. You can listen to our station at caravanradio.co.uk and I'm here to introduce to you another fine video from the Pews on Tour. Good morning and welcome to a new vlog. So today is a review. So we got sent the other week an Engway. What a beast of a machine. That is so beautiful to ride and so comfy. So Engway kindly have sent us another bike which is one of these which is an Engway P20 so we're going to unbox it and we're going to see what it looks like inside because we've got summer planned with two e-bikes one's going to be our lasses and one's going to be mine so we're going to start doing some little bike trips well try that's why I said try <laughs> so you'll have to tune in for future videos for that so let's get this unpacked get it put together and let's see what it looks like hey Pews on tour and youtube family if you're loving the content here's a quick reminder to hit that subscribe button and leave a comment your support means the world right now i've put the bike together it's two days later because all it did is rain so now the sun is shining and as you can see that is one a nice bike it is a city bike so on the front 20 inch wheel plastic mudguard 160 millimeters brake discs hydraulic brakes comes with a side stand hydraulic brakes 20 inch rear rear plastic mudguard this rear rack holds up to 15 kilos says here and it has a belt not a chain so like most anglers of the chain i've never known a bike to go up together so easily so it does have an adjustable seat as you can see it does go a bit high is how easy it is to fold up so what you do is this catch here that goes down to there and this bit it's so easy now doing a bit of reading online e-scooters you're not allowed on trains etc but e-bikes are allowed so this one you're allowed on the train so the battery is removable which comes with which comes with two keys and there's it on off switch this is a 36 volt battery so across the handlebars we've got a nice grip that don't twist or move we've got a rear brake which is hydraulic this catch desired angle we've got a bell and believe it or not these are your left and right indicators which are on the rear which are here and here it does have a rear reflector and also brake lights front brake is uh, hydraulic as well and we've got the computer the computer is so easy you've got passive mode so if we just stick it up up three use the throttle the rear wheels go in but it's in walking mode sorry for uh, the flickering because it's LED display but it's only going at three mile an hour as you can see I have changed it to mile an hour that is the miles done and that is your battery level so after doing some research online I believe I can get into the settings and maybe go make it go faster so you can just pedal it normal with the power assist which it does go up to about 12 mile an hour but if you want to go throttle mode only it'll only do three mile an hour to unlock it 
You press the on button. We go into settings. Hold this button up for 15 seconds. Press the memory button, put up into passive mode, press the throttle and we should get some extra power. 19 mile an hour. I don't think the camera does it justice for the brightness. This bike does about 80 miles on that single little battery. If you pedal it, it'll do 80 miles, but if you keep your finger of what I've just showed you unlocked on the throttle, you're not going to get many miles out of it. Around 20 to 30 miles. I'm going to go out on this Engway and Alice is going to go out on that Engway. So we're going to pop out to somewhere around Hornsey, I think. Are you ready for this? Easy to pedal, is it? Yeah, it's actually. <laughs> <laughs> She's off. Look at her. I don't believe it. She's leaving me. What's going on? A lovely day for it. Okay, it's a nice day. It's easier to pedal than I thought it would be. Yeah. It'd be a size 8 soon. <laughs> What are your brakes like on it? They're alright. They're the alright. The fast brakes. They're keen, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're off again. You're like a little Miss Street Hawk. Just think we've never done this before. I know, they're a bit heavy foot back at motor home, aren't they? Yeah. Let's put this in Power Assist number five. And I programmed it so you just press the throttle and let's see if we can go catch her. As you can see, 32, 33 mile an hour I can get out of this. And I'm 20 stone, 5 foot 10. So if you're lighter than I am, you're going to get some more out of it. Are you waltzing around, love? It is a good looking horse. It doesn't smell either, horses normally stink. Yeah, they do, don't they? Lost its grass. We're just about to go in this churchyard, but there's somebody. I think what it is, it's an old Baptist church and it's now a house. But I think they've still kept it as a sacred ground and that's why they've got all the headstones on it. Yeah. I think it might be a church just for local people only. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And look at this house next to it. That is just spectacular. What does that red light mean on the back of your bike? No. Yeah? Red light. Alright, oh, okay. <laughs> Who says I can't film and ride? <laughs> <laughs> I crashed a little bit. 
I was trying to look for blackberries. <laughs> Legs are a bit numb for being on the bike. <laughs> that was a better ride than I thought it would be. I'm not going to vlog too much here because of the wind. I thought I'd show you the bikes so. though. There he is. I'm going to go get us a brew. What a pair of lovely bikes. So I've been riding this one, and our lass has been riding this one. What a laugh! I can imagine doing this abroad in some nice places and it is a bit fresh out there. So we're in Hornsey and uh, our lass has just gone into that cafe for a couple of coffees and you've got the public toilets here. And our chip shop is just here where you can get proper fish cake and chips. Our lass has got a bit of a squeaky wheel but I've just found out because it's new in it, it's, it's just dry. It needs a uh, a lubricating, I should say. And she's here with a bruise. Just like a wife's supposed to do. Look after their husbands. What, love? Nothing. Just Stop. saying how much I adore you. Stop saying about my, my hair. I can't help that I'm growing baby hair. I am not talking about your beard. Uh, I meant my hair on my head. The hair everywhere. Oh, you're saying what a lovely wife you are getting yeah. me a brew. I got you a, a white American. <coughs> and I've looked at your wheel. Yeah. And because it's brand new, it, there's no oil or anything down there. It's just bone dry. Right, okay. So it, it just needs a bit of grease on the... Yeah, a bit of lubrication it needs, basically. Can I fix it off to the pub? Oh my God, this... People sitting on this seat after sitting on that one. It's like sitting on Jason Momoa. <laughs> Let's catch him. The bike battery's run out. So Mr Pew, <laughs> look at that big one's a beast, you know. So he's, he's rode it, to be fair, he's pedalled that about three mile, aren't you? No, and we're still nearly four mile away, so he's going to go get the van. In absolute true Trisha style. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that? My bike fell over. <laughs> In absolutely true Trisha style, this battery fell out, has died as well as this battery. So, it is a really good bike. Like I said, I've done 15 miles on the pedal assist. I do weigh 20 stone though. So, if you're skinnier, it's going to go further. I think I weigh 20 stone, 4 pounds, something, something, daft, something along them lines. Can I just got to get the van? Because he has pedalled it for a bit. Because uh, he did that before it died. Then we've done another three mile on top of that. And we're still 3.7 miles from home. And I know that because I stopped here earlier. On the video. I stopped here and we were talking. And I says, so God, I can't believe I've done 3.7 miles. Doesn't even feel like it. So that's how I know I've done 3. Point, that we're still 3.7 miles from home. So he's a way for the van. I says to him, just leave me your phone. I'll ring one of the kids. They can laugh at me. <laughs> Look who's come and rescue me! <laughs> I can't believe how quickly you got there and back. Uh, recovery service. <laughs> I think, as much as this is a really good bike, I think the fibbed about it goes 100 mile an hour, uh, 100 miles. Yeah, I don't think it does 100 it, miles. No chance, because I know it's going to do less because I'm bigger. What did it do on clock? 16 mile, something like that. 15.2 miles it did. And I know I'm bigger, but there's no way that's doing 100 mile an hour. 100 mile an hour, 100 mile. <laughs> but yes, he's come to save me in the van. Cube's <laughs> rescue, two pound a mile. <laughs> Bill, my husband. He pays all the bills, invoice, Gareth Pew. I'll tell you what, it's a long way down that road. I, I said to you, didn't I? That's why I go get the van. But that, I can't believe how quickly the bike got you back. Oh yeah, flow That other bike's sick, you know, after riding 33 it. 33 mile an hour down there. It's all Paul on way out. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, that other bike, we might keep that, you know. It's, it's a good nice bike, bike, that. Isn't it? Not being saved! And I've spent, I had a good conversation with the kids as well. Look. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Fuel recovery. It's got two batteries now when you turn it on, on it. I don't know what's wrong with it, will you? It was... Works for me. <laughs> it's a good little bike. I don't think I'm equipped to go, I'm that ass is killing people, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> my hip's hurting and my backside. But it's been a long time since I've sat on a bike for over 10 miles. I don't think I've ever sat on a bike for over 10 miles since I was about 8 years old. So I'm built for loving, not exercising. <laughs> so I am going to go in, chill out, put my eating on. It's a bit cold now today. I don't know what else is going on this video. It might just be this. I'll let you know. Get in and get the heating on. It's cold in it now. Believe it or not. Can you hear it? When oh, did you put the diesel heat on when you come home from yeah, van? So when you're Woo! walking, it's going to be boiling fire. Yay! What are you doing with this? That. Do you need to oh. put it away? That. Should I for the heating on? Yeah. Uh, that is for the uh, Angie and the dog shit bandit. That's going in the bin because it don't work. Oh, no, done it? No. Is that why I give you it? So you have to get rid of it? I think so, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's quite funny. How rude of you, Angie. <laughs> uh, Paul, that's, it's, that's... If you didn't know it was broke, fair enough, it's broke. I'm not bothered. But if you did, no. And I gave it to him. Top tier. Amusement, that. Top tier. <laughs> so, guys, I am actually going to put an end on this video. Thank you for watching. Just so you got all the bike ride and that all and it's Todd. Um, I just want to say thank you to Wendy and Mick who yeah. bought us a coffee. Thank you so much. And we really do appreciate it, guys all the stuff that you're buying us. Um, especially we know times are hard for everybody so it massively means a lot. And if you haven't bought us anything we also love you as well. Because we know that everybody can't afford it. So thank you. And no, you're not allowed to be rude to people. <sighs> And if you can't afford anything by sending us loads of money because we love begging <laughs> all you have to do is just hit the like button and leave a comment that's all we ask and subscribe if you've not subscribed uh, we appreciate all the support guys massively and just in case you didn't know i was on caravan radio today and the dude that the host on caravan radio said he thinks i'm funny <laughs> and i don't think he's wrong hi to the pews on tour now this is a youtube channel well worth watching uh if you like a bit of blue uh it's one for you uh but they basically they live in the caravan and they have so much fun and they've launched a video today and I, it's 20 minutes of my life i'm not going to get back but they're taking on the mcdonald's 10 uh, burgers in a row challenge i didn't know there was a mcdonald's 10 burgers in a row challenge but do have a look at the <laughs> do have a look at the video they're very funny uh but a little bit blue at times bye <laughs>